Hi everyone and welcome back to some more Civilization 6. So, let's continue where we left off. We need three more capital cities, so this shouldn't take too much longer. I think the longest part will be actually moving our army across the continent to take the Russian capital. That will take like 10, maybe 15 turns. But first, let's take Madrid. Because that's the last city we need from Gorgo. Shouldn't take too long. That's Mechanaz Infantry. We'll attach the balloon to the rocket artillery. Alright. Let's keep moving, people. We still need to actually get there. And there's some tough terrain on the way. No, I'm not giving you free stuff. Sorry. Oh yeah, we are also about to finish nuclear fission. But I don't think we'll have enough time to build the Manhattan Project and then build a nuke. I might still try, but I'm pretty sure the game will be done before we finish a nuke. Not to mention we still need a bomber, so yeah. Probably won't have enough time for that. But we'll see. I usually try to nuke something right at the end of the game. This should be an upgrade. And... So, do we want to try taking Tenochtitlan with two units? I suppose we can try. Also, we got some barbarians incoming. Do we have a unit nearby? We are about to finish a tank, actually. And we can harvest the deer. It's outside of workable range anyway. So this will finish the tank. And we can send the tank to Melbourne or something. In case we'll need it there. So, builder. We got one build left. I think I'll keep that guy to repair tiles in case he's going to be necessary. Yep. So, disembark. And we got a new builder. Do we need to repair anything in the area? I don't think so, no. Looks mostly fine to me. That's a district, isn't it? No, that's a plantation. So, we'll repair that then. Still need to get rid of that jet fighter. It's funny how he's using our airport, or aerodrome, whatever. That has to be some kind of bug, but... We'll get rid of it, doesn't really matter all that much. Battleship, where can we move it? It's not going to be super useful. Yeah, I guess we can move it towards the Nochtitlan, and then declare war? It will get there in six turns. We'll wait for that. And with her battleship, we can take that city quite easily. We can also capture one more builder, so... Let's do that, shall we? And we'll wait for the battleship. So, research. Composites. Wait, we still need one more tank. What? I thought we own three tanks already. Don't we? Well, I guess we don't. That's weird. Yeah, we need one more. I don't think I want to wait for that then. But we could still chop some forests. And that shouldn't take too long. Okay, maybe we'll wait for that then. Let's get lasers instead. To get the jet fighter and the missile cruiser, which we'll probably never use. So. We got... how many builds on this guy? Just one. Right. We can grab a mine or something like that. Yep. So, Madrid. We need... maybe two more turns to start attacking it, or three more turns. Let's stay outside of city bombardment range until our rocket artillery gets there. We won't even need everything. Definitely not. There. The jet fighter is gone. Looks good. I like how she still has a settler and it just sits in there, inside the city. NASA. Which is weird, because there are still valid locations for cities, but whatever. And yeah, our tile just got pillaged. Is that a district? That is actually a district. Well, it doesn't really matter. Just keep moving. 
And right, production. We could grab a temple, which isn't going to be useful. Or just continue the repairs. It's already in the queue, so what's going on? That's strange. Can we not repair it? Oh, it's because there's a unit on top of it, right. And voice. I don't think we need any. No, we still control all three city-states that we wanted to stay allied with. I didn't really need that destroyer, but I got it anyway. <laughs> because I can. Why not? Right, so let's harvest the deer, and I think that will either finish the tank, or it will be very close to finishing it. The silly jungle will slow us down. Oh well, it's fine, Madrid will be ours, regardless. I don't even think Gorgo has any real units to defend herself with. It doesn't look like it. How about we get rid of that ironclad? with the field cannon. That sounds like a good idea. And then repair the district. Yep, it got pillaged again. Well, I guess that's to be expected. Let's get rid of it then. And upgrade to a machine gun, that will help. More firepower. So harvest, and that's going to be... 334 production. And that finishes the tank. And now we got composites bust. Nice. We'll use him for an army or something. Let's send him towards Tenochtitlan. Yep. Sure. But I am waiting for the battleship. There's no reason not to be. It's pretty much already there. Or almost there. In this case. Repair back to full. And, oh, another Barbarian? Right, there's a Barbarian camp right here. Let's go and get rid of it. Yeah, we can use the field cannon or whatever. And kill that explorer. Just the rocket artillery and two melee units is enough to take Madrid. We don't need more than that. We don't even need that AT crew for anything, really. Let's start doing damage. This shouldn't take too long. Just a few turns, probably. We could speed it up by using the battle ram, but that's not going to be necessary. Let's just upgrade that. It's a shame you can't increase range on the machine guns, though. Going down from 2 to 1 range kind of sucks. Oh, and we got another great person, a great scientist. Gains 525 science for every artifact in this city. Okay, artifacts in your cities generate 300% of their normal tourism. We do have a few artifacts. In one city, exactly. Well, in more than one city. No, in one city, this one. The rest are great works of art. Yep, so Shizuoka. That's where we need to go. Okay, then. Where's Shizuoka, exactly? Right here. Off you go. Are we there yet? You will stay in Perth. At least until we get the next builder. Is there another barbarian camp in this area? Or where did they spawn? I'm not seeing one, but they have to spawn somewhere. Oh, there is one over here. Yeah, Monte is getting wrecked by barbarians. That's what was happening. Should we just declare war right now? Yeah, we can attack on this turn. Might as well just declare war. Your time has come. Sorry. Nothing personal. We just need your city. I'm sure he doesn't mind. So this should be easy enough. He doesn't even have a garrison anymore. In fact, we can take it in one turn. We didn't even have to wait 
for that battleship, but we did anyway. <laughs> and hey, we can also grab the builders. How nice. Anything to repair? Not really. Just the lighthouse. So that was the shortest war ever in the history of everything, apparently. No, the barbarians. Let's get rid of them. I don't want them here. Really, that wasn't enough. Okay, apparently it wasn't. No problem. We'll grab it on the next turn. Back to Madrid! Let's see, we can attack from this style. Once we take Madrid, we just need St. Petersburg. So, that will be the longest part, actually moving our units across. Not much point staying here any longer. We might as well just go to St. Petersburg. Sure, let's go there. Why not? It has all kinds of districts. We might as well start moving some of these units. Yeah. Alright, let's start moving them then. 17 turns. That will take a while, like I said. There's a bit of a choke point that we have to cross in this area. Alright. Grab a mine or something. I guess I want to be killing the Ironclad. We got better things to do. I like how he's still making demands. Oh, what? Okay, that's a bit of a problem. Hey, our mission succeeded. But we have to get rid of that Mechanaz infantry. <laughs> Whoops! Didn't see that one coming. Well, that's why we got more units in the area. Huh. Okay, I think we'll have to use the artillery for this. Seems that way. But let's play it safe here. Oh yeah, we got a promotion. That will help. Which one do we want? Plus 7 combat strength when defending... Plus 7 combat strength against other heavy cavalry units. Both attacking and defending. That works. Production. We can grab a sewer. And what do we want to do with Russia? It doesn't really matter all that much. We can siphon some funds. So that they won't be able to buy units once we declare war. Grab the science, so that completes lasers. And then we can work on what? Composites. Yep. That's what we needed the tanks for. That's not a very good trade out. Plus 19, that's better. So, new builder. Let's just remove some of these jungles. And we need to repair whatever this is. A quarry? Yep. Some gold. And let's just move it towards Russia. That's basically just a formality. We could probably just buy a unit or two. Maybe. Some rocket artillery or something like that. It's a shame it's not a coastal city, then we could use the battleship. Not that it matters all that much. So, Mechanized Infantry, do we attack or just stay here? Let's just fortify. Right, we are still at war, technically. So how about we kill that? And capture the builders? Yep. We can always use them. Oh yeah, right, there's that barbarian camp still. Should probably take care of it. How many builders did they steal from Montit? A lot, apparently. Okay. Well, that explains why he wasn't able to do anything at all. Nuclear fusion, robotics, stealth technology. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Nanotechnology is fine. We don't need any more techs. We got everything we need at this point. Upgrade the tanks. 
that's going to be helpful. Also a bit expensive. And we got a promotion, and that's going to be volley, it's fine. And get rid of these barbarians. So, how fast can we finish this? The helicopter will get there quickly, obviously. We still have to take Madrid. <laughs> Let's maybe do that first. I like to keep attacking it, if possible. These barbarians don't really matter. I think we can take it on the next turn. Looks like we can, so let's start moving some of these units back. I don't think we'll be able to afford an airport anywhere in this area. How expensive would that be in Corinth? Airport. 3000. Actually, yeah, we could afford it. And then we could do rapid deployment to Novgorod. We do have an airport here, right? Oh, we don't. Right, we are building it. It will be done in four turns. So we can airlift after all. Right, that will speed things up significantly. That's going to be so much faster. Oh yeah, also, we should probably move the fighter. Back we go then, to Corinth. Yep, I'm glad I took that city then. I was considering not doing it. The helicopter might as well just go like this. It will get there in seven turns. That's fast enough. Looks like that means we should be done in 10, maybe 15 turns max. Probably in this episode. This is probably already a bit of an overkill. <laughs> but hey, I like overkill. We mostly just need the rocket artillery to get there. But first, they need to finish their job. This is probably enough. I think it's enough. Is it enough? Maybe it isn't, actually. No, we need one more turn. That's fine. We'll wait one more turn, then. Let's repair all this stuff. That's a lot of pillaged improvements. I don't even know why I'm going in this direction. Obviously, we can't attack their capital from the sea. It's not a coastal city, not even remotely close to a coastal city. A builder that we don't need. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, that ironclad is going to pillage all the sea improvements, but I don't really care all that much. Maybe I would care if the game wasn't close to done, but it is. Just queue up. Maybe not trader. What can we queue up? Industrial zone. Sure, why not? Not that it will be done before the game is finished. Sparta Research Lab. And you? We can grab a few improvements. We can get a seaside resort. Not that we need one, but hey, we got one anyway. Because we can. That's the only reason needed. Just keep these guys here. There's no need to waste time moving them. When we can't use them for anything. Not against Russia, anyway. So, to Corinth. Oh, there's a new mechanized infantry. It's fine, we are about to peace out, I think. I'm pretty sure this is going to be enough. Yes, this is definitely enough. So Madrid is ours. Thanks, Gorgo. Keep the city. And now we can peace out. So let's do it. Unfortunately, she won't give us anything because Gorgo is going to be Gorgo. So all we can really do is white peace. That's the annoying part about her. So... Yeah, we need to give her at least one gold. <laughs> yeah, whatever. She is a pretty annoying opponent. Probably the most annoying opponent in the game. But now we're done. Just queue up whatever. To fill the queue. 
synagogue. What's that exactly? One citizen's lot. Right, so now we just have to go back to Corinth. Might as well just buy that airport right away because we'll need it one way or the other. That's the whole idea here. Then we'll airlift and declare war on Russia. And that's the game done! So Gorgo tried to put up a fight, but no other AIs did. Not quite what I expected. It's a bit of a shame, but at least Gorgo tried to fight. She kept up in science for a pretty long time. And oh, we got a great general. Sure, why not? He will be useful. Siphon funds. And the trader? Just send him wherever. Lisbon is fine. Oh, hold on, another barbarian, really? Get out of here. There has to be another barbarian camp somewhere in the area. So let's attach the general to one of the tanks. Yep, to these guys. It's fine. And keep the destroyer here. Go to sleep. We can grab the farm. And spend almost all of our current gold. Because why not? And a lot of repairs needed. Are we there yet? Right, how many turns do we need to get to Corinth? Eight turns! Right, well, there are mostly no roads. Okay, it's still faster than moving all the way across the continent. So I suppose that's what we'll do. And we should probably peace out with Monty. There's no need to stay at war. Why is the helicopter here? What? It shouldn't be there. Many, many rules had begun to bend. Might as well kill these the units, since we are already here. This produced a lot of good. And peace out with Monty? Oh, we can't actually do it yet. Right. Fine. Nuclear fusion. And the trader again. Just go wherever. Laventa. Oh yeah, we got a few more builders that we can capture. Not that we really need them, but they are available, so whatever. That's already repaired. Hi Russia, we are coming for you. Attach and you will wait. Turn 403. Remember, we are playing epic game pace. But I expected roughly around 400 turns to finish this. So, Corinth, just queue up whatever. A builder? It still needs a few improvements, so... Well, actually, there is a builder here. We can grab a trader. And then it can get a road. <laughs> a little bit too late, although... Well, maybe it's not too late, actually. We can chop the forest. Oh, that went to the wrong city. Damn it. <laughs> but we can still chop a different forest, I suppose. Yeah, that went to the other city. We can chop the forest, finish the trader faster, and use the trader to build the road. And maybe at least some of the units will use it. They probably will, by the time they actually get there. Oh yeah, there is a barbarian camp right here. Yeah, we'll go get rid of that. That's pretty annoying. Airlift time on the next turn, I suppose. I like how she's still not moving that settler. And there's a nice location for a city over here, for example. It's weird. Oh well, it's not like she's going to do it now. That's unlikely to happen. So, airlift. Let's go. 
I wonder if we could do it without the rocket artillery. We probably could. With the machine guns. I think we could. We can always try. Off you go. I don't think Russia has a lot of tech. Probably not. What era are they in right now? They are in Atomic Era, right. So they might have a few decent units. But that's about it, really. I don't expect miracles. And we can always use the battering ram with the tanks. That's a pretty funny combo. But hey, it works. That's the important part, right? Oh yeah, we are still at war with Monty. Not that he's much of a threat. Let's go get rid of that barbarian camp. I like how the barbarians were basically a bigger threat than Monty. A way bigger threat than Monty. Or, well, they were mostly a nuisance, but at least they did something. Instead of just sitting there. Not doing anything useful. When we look up at night and view the stars, oh, and we got nuclear fusion. Unfortunately, we won't be dropping a nuke in this game because there's just not enough time to do that. Maybe another time. So, should we merge these two? Nah, they are a bit too experienced for that. Not worth it. Another airlift. Off you go. And move slightly out of the way. To not block the tiles. Now we got three units on the same tile. Brisbane? What do you need? So where is fine. Just wait for your turn. We can move one tile closer. I think the machine guns would actually be enough, but... We can wait for the rocket artillery. Now we got the trader, and we can send him where? Where's the rocket artillery right now? Right here. Yeah, we can send it through here. It might speed it up by, like, one turn. How about we send it to Madrid? Which way will it go? Or just like this. To build a road. I'm pretty sure it will save us at least one turn, maybe two turns. And queue up a bomber. That's fine. And we'll bring the modern armor too. Yeah, sure, it can get there pretty quickly. Three more builds. That won't really be needed for anything. Grab that builder. And that's it. Oh, another barbarian incoming, really? Well, that's why I want to get rid of that barbarian camp. And we are still at war with Monty. Why is our mechanized infantry here? What? That makes no sense. Not sure what he's doing there, but all right. We'll move it elsewhere. He actually has a great library in here. Good for him. Production sewer. Oh yeah, helicopter is almost there. Looks good. Move out of that airport to make some space. And repair. I'm not even going to bother using some of these builders anymore. There's just no need. It will slow things down. And at this point, there's no need to drag this out any more than it needs to be. A lift and... Yep, that's it on this turn. The artillery is almost there. That's all we need. Once we get the artillery, we'll be declaring war. And the game will be done! That's the last capital we need. Oh yeah, and we can peace out at this point. Really? You want gold? 
Are you crazy? I think he's crazy. We avoid bloodshed, according to Gorgo. We took how many cities from her? Maybe she's trying to write some kind of alternative history. Clearly that's what's happening here. Or maybe she's just crazy. That's a possibility. Right, let's just queue up whatever is relevant, the trader. We are almost ready, just need that rocket artillery, come on. I'll lift. The other one is lagging behind slightly. How many turns do we need on the other one? It's right here. A few more. I don't think I'm going to wait for the other one. We'll just declare war. On the next turn, it can always join in after a turn or two. Or three. Yep, sounds good. Repair all of these. This is a pretty damn nice city. It's a shame Monty didn't manage to do much with it. So, Russia. Where's your army, Russia? He's supposed to have over 1,000 military strength? Where are all these units then? Because I'm not seeing any. That's curious. Well, he does have some units in this area. Maybe we should wait for that rocket artillery. I mean, it's basically here already. And we got one more modern armor incoming. Oh, right, I never actually moved that jet fighter. Whoops! We probably should. Yeah, let's just wait one more turn or two more turns. We are basically already there with the rocket artillery. Just repair all of these. Oh yeah, new policy or just an upgraded version? Right, we got e-commerce, so that's that. Accept. Right. Come on, let's finish this. That upgrade was totally unnecessary. <laughs> okay, another recovery incoming. Right, we need to repair that mechanized infantry. Or we'll actually lose it at this point. Now I'm not interested, whatever you have to offer. Wait, what? Where did that musket man come from? Is there another barbarian camp? Well, apparently there might be. No wonder Monty got wrecked. Especially when he was this far behind with Tex. He was getting pounded by barbarians pretty much constantly. Alright. So where? Oh, new government? I don't need a new, any new government, sorry. So, should we declare war already? Where's that other rocket artillery? Right here. So, airlift. And modern armor. We can also airlift that, and that's all the relevant units that we needed. Let's declare war then. Not much point waiting. I'm just wondering where exactly all his units are. He clearly has the military strength. Oh, it went down to 588 now. That's interesting. I wonder if there's some kind of bug with military strength. Because that's not the first time it happens. Well, I don't know. Doesn't matter. Let's get started. This won't take very long. I don't think so. No, it definitely won't take very long. That's not quite what I had in mind. Move in. And move in. We can use the machine gun. Yeah, I give the city maybe two turns. Three turns max. That's all it will take. We can just attack with the modern armor. Because why not? It will make it faster. Yeah, we'll just take the city on the next turn, actually. 
We certainly will. So that's it, game over. We are done. I'm not even going to use any more units. Because it's not needed. Yes, I'm disappointed too. <laughs> that's life. Hi, Russia. <laughs> I think you have a problem. I'm just saying. And that's it. We are done. Let's grab the city. There we go. A smashing victory. Your actions this day, you ensure our people a glorious tomorrow. I think this was technically my first post-release game finished with domination victories, <laughs> which is pretty funny. So ranking, replay. Any interesting data here? Let's have a look. Gold balance. Yep. We had quite a lot of gold. Science per turn. Yeah, Gorgo passed us in science per turn for a while. But then something happened. <laughs> I wonder what that was. Total buildings. Yeah, we were number one for almost the entire game. Gorgo was slightly ahead. Very, very briefly. Total cities lost. Guess who's in the lead? Total districts constructed. Yeah, Gorgo was also in the lead there for a while. Total great people earned. That's a lot of great people for Gorgo. Didn't help her. Total number of combats. Total units killed. Total units lost. Total wars against player. Wait, who's that? That's China, alright. Total wars declared, wonders constructed. What's this? Oh yeah, that's us, right. So I guess that's it. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time.